I think uh, Ronnie mentioned something to it. I don't think it was just a pipe dream, but I think it come along as he gets a little bit older and wiser. Uh, I think he said he's con contemplating retirement maybe early next year, maybe in March. So uh, he's, as he gets along there, so there are some uh, good things about Amen. growing old. <laughs> We can, we can kind of, all right, we got two down here, two knotheads. Did you, did you know or do y'all know that y'all are cousins? Some like fourth cousins, I think. I don't know what that means. You just look like trouble to me. I also uh, heard this morning, didn't know uh, that, that uh, until Terry uh, came by earlier, that Danny Ward had surgery, rotator cuff surgery on Friday. So say a prayer for Danny. He's, he's probably not feeling great. Yeah. And uh, got some recuperation. Those of you who had serious surgery, especially some of you recently, I know how to pray for him particularly. Now, I am going to use Super Dummy this morning. This is, this is very old. I've had this for a long time. This is older than you are. Still in good shape, though. It is a punching bag. I want to talk to you. It's kind of a complex subject this morning because... Uh, all of us, all people, we have a tendency, there's part of who we are as human beings, we, we uh, sometimes like to punch stuff. We get mad, and sometimes we, we kind of want to punch somebody. You have probably ne never hit your sister, have you? Got it? <laughs> all right, the altar is right here. I don't know if you know what that's for you. We'll kind of learn as we go. I don't know why, this keeps coming in my, my brain. Uh, it's from, uh, I think, uh, Finding, uh, it's not Finding Nemo. Who, who was uh, Dora? Finding Dora. Is that it? Doreen. Doreen. And where the, the shark is, is trying to learn a new uh, lifestyle. And he says that fish are what? You remember? What are fish? Fish are friends. Fish are not friends. Not food. Not food. Fish are friends, not food. So, uh, I'm actually going to be talking. You see, that's a picture of a, a place in the Middle East where they're having a war right now. They're having a war. And many, many people are being hurt or killed. It's, it's far too serious a subject for someone your age. But we've got to talk about it a little bit. We, we play sports. Yesterday, I'm so tired, I played football all day yesterday. <laughs> Tim says, I, I just asked him a question, all he could say was roll tide, so you know, he's one of those. <laughs> we like to run into each other, and, and football is very physical and violent. We put on pads and crash into each other. We even have boxing and wrestling and fighting. People will actually go to see a fight, and, and there are people who are champions, and, and uh, we, we compete with each other, and sometimes, I think sometimes we forget, and it spills over into our, our everyday life. We need to realize that hurting other people or punching other people or becoming angry at other people is not something that Jesus wants us to do. He wants to deliver us from that. We have a, we have a habit, we have a tendency, and I believe sometimes when we're playing the games, there's nothing wrong with the games. I think sometimes we, we have punching bags so it won't punch people. Let me show you something. There's a PowerPoint on the desktop there, Carter, called Punch. Uh, bring that up. This was from many years ago. I think this was, uh, I know this was at Oak Park. I believe it was, it was before Johnny and Gene. Camp Helen, were y'all there? That, that, that was before y'all, I think. Now, uh, Camp Helen was a church camp over in Limestone County, and we went over there from our church, and there's a, a lot of our uh, church members from Oak Park were there, and we went there, and we, we we camped out at Camp Helen for several days. It was right after Kim Palmer's wedding at church. So before we left for camp, they loaded us up with lots of wedding food. I remember that. So we ate like kings out there in, in the woods. Now, uh, I did something that I had been doing for many years. And that was, I used to, I used to study karate. I used to, that was one of the things I did, play baseball and football. But I, I did martial arts as well. So that's me and my son. That's Jonathan Bain. And we're, we're doing some forms there. We're in our karate uniforms called a gi. And uh, we were teaching some Christian truths. 
And uh, instead of punching each other or beating somebody up, I said, well, the Lord wants me to use karate to talk about Jesus. So we had everybody's in their relaxation clothes there. Hit that next slide there, Carter. And uh, I was about to break some boards there with my head. I wanted to show this to you because this really explains a lot about me. Yeah. You say, well, now we know what's wrong with, with him. He's been breaking boards with his head. So hit that next slide. You can see there's a stack of boards. And they, if you do that many times, it, you turn up like this. All right? Hit that next slide. That's uh, Carice Bain, later Carice Buell. She's had her part in the show. She's breaking a board there. Yeah. Actually had her name written on that board. And she broke that thing, just went, went right through, broke a board. She was a part of the show as well as it was like uh, Terry didn't want, didn't have a part, but she didn't really, she's, you can see that's her right there. You know, if you look around for Terry, you're always going to see her with a baby in her lap. Yeah. So that's all right. Let's go to the next slide. And uh, that's Jonathan laying down there and he got a watermelon. That's Cody, our nephew. And that's one of the, uh, uh, the Moore boys right there. And I've got a knife, I'm blindfolded, a big sword, and I'm cutting that watermelon in half on Uncle Bud's stomach. That's kind of wild. All right, let's look at another, just a few more. Hit the next one. All right, now that's this bag right there. Kicking it. And that's Morgan Besley here. He's holding it there when he was just a teenager. All right, next one. And that's Jonathan. He's kind of, y'all come up here with me. I, I, want you, I want you to hit this bag a little bit. Come on up here. Let, let's get you on camera here. And uh, come up here on stage. And let's, let's do a super dummy right here. I'm going to show you how to hit the, the dummy. Okay. Do you know how to make a fist, Avery? All right. Now I want you to hold the bag first. Put your hands right in there. Hold that. And that. All right. Hold it up to me. I'm going to make a fist. And there's a circle right there. Let's go. Pow. All right, now let me hold it. You make a fist. Now, I don't want you to hurt your hand or anything, but step right over here. I'm going to back up a little bit. All right, grab right back and punch that circle. All right, hit it again. Now try your other hand. Let's see if you can hit it with the other hand. Now, makes you want to go hit uh, Addison, doesn't it? <laughs> Owen, okay, can you make a fist? Come up here. I want you to punch the super dummy, okay? Ready? Wow! Look at where back. All right, it. do it again. All right, use your other hand. All right. Remember, fish are friends, not food. <laughs> <laughs> I used to have a bag that hung from the ceiling, and then when I get mad, Miss Terry would go out there and punch on that. Hit it again. Hit it one more time. Can you hit it like one two? Go one two. One hand. On. All right, yeah. hit one hand and then the other. Left, right. Woo. There you go. You try left, right real quick. How quick can you do it? All right, do it again. All right, that's super dummy, super dummy. <laughs> now, if you ever get mad at somebody, don't, don't hit people. Don't hit people. Don't, uh, don't punch them. Keep you cool. You know what Jesus said? He said, if someone hits you, don't hit them back. Don't hit them back. That's, that's hard to do. That's very hard to do. But that's what he wants us to do. There's always going to be someone who wants to push you or someone who wants to call you an ugly name or someone who wants to uh, say something unkind. And you might just want to punch them. Instead, punch the super dummy instead, okay? Don't hit people. Jesus was someone who believed that if we hurt other people, we can't help them. All right? Boy. All right, thank you very much. Y'all can go sit down then and go back with your folks. Uh, as I said, it's kind of a strange or unusual lesson for church, but uh, boy, I, I have a tendency to want to punch people sometimes myself. And I think sometimes things can get out of hand. All right, let's, let's bring our ushers forward and our, receive our collection.